All right, guys, I got one more pair of shoes, not for me. I actually bought these for my daughter, and these are tread safe. And she's always like, Dad, you always buy me boy stuff. <laughs> but uh, these are definitely women's, but they probably look like men's. I buy black because, of course, I ruin everything. If I, if I don't buy something black or dark color, I end up working in it and it stains it up and can't use it for anything but work. So, and <clears throat> we're running a lot, we're doing a lot of stuff outside and we're uh, on slick surfaces and we're riding on uh, many segways. Um, we're always racing back and forth to the vehicles, racing to the store. Everywhere we go, it's a race. So I bought her some uh, shoes last week and the week before and uh, her feet are growing. And uh, a lot of the shoes she had in the past were real slick on the bottom. And so these are the only shoes that I've noticed throughout the years that have skid, like a skid safe, it tread safe. It, these, I mean, you can still slip and fall, but you're a lot less likely to. And with kids, they're always, <laughs> always uh, running at top speed and they're always, uh, you know, running on slick surfaces. No matter what you tell them, they're always going to run. So this is going to be maybe save her from uh, getting hurt or falling uh, more than normal. And also, too, they're black and they're uh, water resistant. And of course, you know, kids are always going to get filthy dirty. With these, I don't care what she gets into, grease, dirt, oil, uh, mud, you can just rinse them off, and wipe them down with like a wet a wet rag, and then they have a little foam uh, cushion insole. And usually what I do is uh, once, once they pull their foot in and out a few times, if this insole uh, starts to come out and give them a problem, I just glue it in. So I'll see how how good this uh, works and really these shoes were what how much were they 30 bucks I think they were like 30 bucks she's gonna outgrow these shoes in probably two or three months so I bought them a little bit big on and uh, but she's still gonna outgrow them and before she wears them out so I'm not really concerned about um, buying like real expensive shoes a lot of people buy like, uh, you know, Jordans or shoes that are 100 bucks, 150 bucks or whatever. I'm not gonna buy $150 shoes. And a lot of times too, like it used to be only Nikes and Adidas and your higher end shoes were built with high quality. Now, even these are very comfortable. This is what I wear it myself too. So um, these are one of the most comfortable pairs of shoes you can buy and these are the only ones that have the non-slip sole that actually work. So for me, I think this is the best deal for your money, especially for when you're buying for kids that are only gonna wear them for two or three months. They'll hold up, they'll keep them from falling, and also they can't stain these. So all around, these, I think these are the best shoes, bang for your buck, and they're gonna hold up the best. And also too, you can wear them with, uh, <clears throat> you know, shorts or whatever, or you can wear them with dress pants or, you know, so they're very versatile. Um, I don't know. I think they're pretty decent for 30 bucks. So anyway, there's the sole and you can see these are the kind that, um, they're really hard to slip. These, I mean, you, you still can, but these are one of the best types of sole for slip resistance. They have all these little surface areas to grab. And then this here is, this surface is real easy to clean. You can just take a wet rag and wipe them down and they usually come clean. And then they also have, uh, they don't have any um, shoelaces and they have two places where you can put your finger and pull them, pull them on your foot. So I don't know. This is Roger with Roger's Reviews. And uh, if you got kids, <laughs> These are one of the best shoes to buy. They're not, they're inexpensive. 
and they'll keep them safe and they'll keep them from uh, slipping unnecessarily. So anyway, that's all I have and uh, I'll see you on the next one. Walmart.com.